What's up YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. Uh, I'm G Martin and in this video I'm going to be doing an unofficial review on a Team G H9 board which I just recently picked up. of a lot of things. I'm gonna go over kind of the range I'm able to get with the board, the overall portability of the board, and basically just whether or not you should buy one if you are even looking for one. So. All right, this is gonna be the first of one of many stops. I don't really know where to stand. Actually, I'm just going to hold the camera. So this is stop one. We are at, oh, I can barely see the screen. Let's see if you can see it. Probably not. Uh, 1.4 kilometers. Battery still is at full. Uh, we're just going to continue with this trip and see where it takes us. Those of 
you who wanna know how fast this board actually is, I'm gonna do a little speed pull here. Three, two, one. 16, 25, 30, 35, 38, 40. Oh, there we go. Stop at stop signs. I just need to say this real quick. This board is a hell of a lot of fun. I mean, it's quick, but like not too quick where you're gonna hurt yourself constantly. But then at the same time, if you need to get somewhere and you don't feel like walking, this will get you there like 10 times as fast. The pros are definitely there. I mean, the only con is really the safety factor of, you know, riding a kneeboard. And then also, if you have the money to buy one, because some people don't. But, let me get this road real quick. I mean, if you have the money to drop on a board like this, I would highly recommend it. It's a hell of a lot of fun. And I think it'll pay off. Now, for me, why did I get a board? Uh, it's mainly for college. So I go to UC, and if you know anything about UC, campus is kind of big, a lot of people walk, but recently a lot of people have been getting e-boards. So I basically said, why not? I'm gonna buy one and try it out. So I'm gonna be riding this for class when school starts back up, which I'm super excited about. But with that being said, I think I'm gonna have to end that video there. Uh, thanks for taking the time to watch this video. I hope it kind of talks you a little bit more about this board and maybe just e-boards in general. So, also sorry for the wind noise. I'm kind of riding my board, obviously, but you make do with what you got. So, yeah, see you in the next one.